My programming skills weren't the greatest and I couldn't figure out how to get this to work in software. Uh, it's a little, the programming on the Nano is a little bit different now. And, or sorry, not the Nano, the TNC 4.1. So I got some learning to do. But anyway, this is the general idea of it. You got your, um, your TNC 4.1 and uh the panda on here works great and on the last one i made a huge mistake so i misread this so like your dual gps goes like way up here on seven and eight and then like the one you're supposed to be looking at goes down here but i have found if you only have one gps it doesn't matter which one you go into so that's just kind of a an accident but it works i don't think it was uh meant to be but that's the way it is so at any rate, what I am trying to do here is I have a um, Ethernet to TTL adapter here, and I have an Ethernet to TTL adapter here, and then I have this going out to the computer. So what I'm trying to pull off is I don't need to have the GPS 100% tied in uh, to like a board or anything. And you might wonder, what's the benefit to this? So the benefit is, is like right now I'm running the, uh, the magical, wonderful, uh, F9P, but what happens if I get a new receiver and I want to see if it works any better, if it's stuck to my board, that kind of hamstrings me. So if I could just send the data in by UDP as well, then I could just throw anything in that connects by, um, by UDP and, and I got her built. Or uh, if you could just get GGA basically in here um, through AgIO, you'd have her build. It wouldn't matter where it was. It would just get there because the bus speed of using UDP is so much higher than using um, uh, like a UART or anything. I think it should pull this off. I just don't know how to pull it off in software. So uh, yeah, so I got everything talking. I actually, yeah, soldered it in the right position there. And then, uh, yes, so Agio is happy. And I got a RTK fix. And I've got a, uh, a new, new rendition of uh, Panda here to try out. But um, I really think it would be a smart idea if you're not hamstringing the GPS location by having it have to be like right here. If you can just put it on the UDP network and just have it like, um, you know, it, it can be anywhere, like literally anywhere you want to put the GPS unit, uh, you just need to have an ethernet cable there and boom, off you go. Uh, if it's gotta be like inches away from this board, uh, then that uh, the creativity level goes way down. And I think we, it, like it's a definite possibility. I just don't know right now how to do that in there.